Hi, and thank you for joining me for this Minimal Cues Vinyasa Flow Sequence. A sequence probably 20 minutes in length, a little bit of warm up um, and some standing balances, uh, and then a slow down at the end. Um, but helpful to know names of postures because I'm not gonna give you any cues, um, any placements, um, any breath. I'm just gonna tell you where we are going, uh, transitioning from posture to posture, from asana to asana. So it's helpful, as I say, to know the names of postures. Um, but you're, of course, welcome to, to give this one a go. And we're gonna start seated just with some breath work. So making yourself comfortable. Beginning seated at the front of your mat, taking a few deep inhales and exhales through the nostrils. Tuning into the flow of your breath, preparing the mind for your practice to find flow state from your vinyasa flow sequence today. Maybe you would like to invite an intention for practice and whatever resonates with you at this particular moment, maybe something just springs to mind, an I am statement of affirmation or a sankalpa. beginning to wiggle the fingers, circle the wrists, circle the shoulders, dropping chin to chest, scooping through the front body, releasing the spine, lifting up, pressing chest to sky, releasing back once more, scooping through the front, Chin raises, chest lifts, once more releasing, breathing out, breathing in, chest lifts, spine is long, bring center, take a twist, bring center, take it to the other side. Bring center, lift the arms up, interlace the fingers, press the palms away. Release the hands, right hand come down, lateral stretch over to the side. Looking up underneath that lifted arm, roll the shoulder just a little and release to the other side. Roll the shoulder. And release. Let's bring the hands forward and send the knees back into your tabletop. Sway the hips from side to side. A few little circles forward and back. And the other way. Find a few rounds of cat and cow with your breath here, tucking the toes underneath for cow. Exhaling for cat.
Last time, wide leg child's pose, toes touch, exhale, arms reach forward. Inhale, bring yourself to tabletop, right foot comes forward. Wing that foot out to the side, drop the hips forward for your dragon. And just left hand goes to the top corner as you sweep around, lifting up the hip. And back into half splits. Sweeping right leg all the way back around, opening up into tiger. And releasing, left leg comes forward, winging into your dragon. Right hand comes down. Twisting back, lifting hip, raising arm up over the head. Bringing back into center, returning to half splits. Hands come on in the center, lifting left leg, sweeping all the way back around, opening up to tight. Returning to tabletop, tucking toes, exhale, downward facing dog. Pedal through the feet. Left leg bends, twist underneath right. Right leg bends, left leg straight, twisting under left. Release back to center, release both heels together. Looking forward, walking the feet towards the hands, taking to the front of your mat, exhale, fold. Ganesh arms into a sway. And then release. Fold. You'll tow the feet out into your malasana and then dropping right knee down, opening left. Dropping left knee down, opening right. Returning to malasana, dropping hips, hands to heart. Releasing hands, lifting sit bones, heel, toe, feet to parallel. Right arm threads through between the legs to come into a bind as you lift the right heel. Roll the left shoulder open and maybe you keep that heel lifted or you can release it down and straighten through the left leg. Nice and slowly release, left arm threads through. Lifting left heel. Exhale, heel comes down. Right leg straight. Nice and slowly release hands. Exhale, fold. Breathe in. Lift up. Exhale, hands down to Tadasana as you find standing. Figure of eights with the arms. Exhale, elbows by hips as you release to fold. Inhale, bring the arms up to salute. Exhale, hands by hips. 
Breathe in, arms above the head, figure of eight with the arms twice more. The last time we take a nice melt, chest to thighs, release. Inhale, hands to shins, half lift. Exhale, release. Right leg steps back. Find a nice low lunge here, inhaling the arms up and interlace the fingers to press back down the thigh. Release hands, step back, down dog to find a connecting vinyasa. Knees, chin, chest, or chaturanga up dog. Inhale, right leg lifts up and back behind you. Sweep leg through, open it up, warrior two. Find a bind here with the reverse warrior, hand comes to front thigh, lifting up. Straighten through the front leg. Bringing center, sweep over to triangle. Extended triangle. Press back up, warrior. Find your side angle, elbow to knee. Release top hand into a bind. Preparing to come to the front of the mat for bird of paradise. Balance, stepping left forward. Lifting right leg. And extending leg if available to you. Releasing leg down and step back left. Find the bind. Release hands, frame front foot, and step back, down dog. A few deep breaths. Inhale, right sweeps up. Comes through to meet the hands. Find a high lunge this time. And hands come into the heart as you take a twist to the left knee. Palms at heart center, gaze to top elbow. Release hands, step forward, exhale, fold. Inhale, arms raise. Exhale, mountain pose. Four figure of eights with the arms at the front of the mat. Exhale, hands by hips. Arms release into the salute. Last time, slow melt, chest to thighs. Inhale, hands to shins for half lift. Exhale, release, step back, left leg, nice low lunge. Inhale, arms raise, interlace fingers, with a different finger on top this time, and press the chest open to the sky as you draw the knuckles down the leg. Release the hands to the mat, step back, exhale, find your downward facing dog, and choose a connecting vinyasa of your choice here, maybe chaturanga, up dog, Ground position, cobra. Inhale, left leg goes up and back behind you. Bring it through and place the foot between the hands into warrior two. Vision from the back here. So you take the hand to the right thigh for your reverse warrior with bind. 
straightening through the front leg, drawing those inner thighs together, reaching back further. And sweep forward, long, wide sweep to Trikonasana Triangle. Extended Triangle. Press through the feet. Warrior two, side angle pose. Finding your bind. Mentally prepare from here for the standing balance. Looking at front foot, stepping forward. Shifting weight to right leg, bird of paradise. Lifting left. Extending the leg if it's available. Releasing left foot down, stepping back to bind. Releasing hands, framing down dog. Inhale, left lifts. Step through to a high lunge. Hands come to heart center for twist. Slowly release. Step forward into fold. Inhale, arms raise. Bring you to standing. Exhale, hands down by the side of the body. Your choice here, if you wish to repeat that sequence, you can just stop the video, rewind, and repeat once more. Or if you've had enough of a little flow this morning and you want to come down and have a little bit of a deeper stretch, let's come down to the mat. Inhale, arms raise, upward salute here, lift up and back. And hands come to the heart center as you fold. Inhale, half lift. Your choice, stepping or hopping back, chaturanga, plank. Down dog. Few deep breaths. Slowly lower the knees, bring the hands back by the hips, and child's pose. Rolling up through the spine. Come into kneeling and just sit nice and tall in thunderbolt position. Keep the left leg bent here so we just release the calf and you can either sit on a block or drop the hips down and bring the right leg forward. Inhale, arms raise, exhale, take a fold over the lengthened leg. Slowly release. And this time draw the knee in towards the chest. And take the hands underneath the foot and extend the leg up into heron. Let go of the leg with the hands. Hold the leg where it is. Lift the chest. Release the leg. Hands come back behind you. We're going to press the hips up to the sky pointing that right foot opening chest. 
Slowly release, drop onto the right hip, left leg comes forward. Paschimottanasana, forward fold. Slowly roll up through the spine and then bring the right leg back. Release the calf and drop the sit bones down to the mat or sit on a block. Inhale, arms raise. Exhale, fold over. Heron fold. Release and roll up, draw the knee in towards the chest. Take the hands underneath, interlace the fingers or use a strap, extend the leg, trying to keep the thigh to the chest, relax the shoulders, lift the chest towards the thigh. Let go of the leg, hold, hold, hold. Breathe and smile, release. And hands come back behind you to lift the hips, pointing that left toe. Slowly release. Sweep the right leg round, butterfly pose. Soles of the feet come together. Release the fold. Trying to keep the body where it is, holding on to the feet. Slide the feet out. They'll naturally turn back inwards into your fold. Releasing, hands come back behind you, upward facing plank, pointing toes, lifting hips. Slowly release hips and right leg draws in for a twist. Bring back into center, keep moving. Bend this right, uh, left leg underneath the right. Lift the hips. You're gonna turn all the way around and then right leg extends. Hopefully you made that transition and you have the left leg bent and twisting to the left. going to go back the other way so bring center right leg bends in you continue all the way around to the back of the mat lifting up the hips and changing the feet and just send the legs out in front of you maybe if you're at the back of the mat shuffle forward just a little bit nice slow roll down we're going to close off our practice drawing knees in towards the chest roll and massage out Circle, one way and the other. Open the knees, circling the hips a little bit, little bit of movement, joint flexibility, circling one way and circling the other. And then finding your relaxation for Shavasana for a few minutes. I will leave you here and close the practice shortly. But for now, take your final relaxation in Shavasana, make yourself warm and comfortable and stay as long as you need here. 
And thank you for joining me today. Namaste.